isn't this wild? We're getting married. It's mysterious to me how for years we've been known each other and only a little over a year ago, the Lord allowed us to see each other as something other than acquaintances. One thing I've grown to love and admire about you is the depth of your love, not just for me, but for everyone around you. It goes without saying that you have loved me well. When I'm wrong, you call me out. When I'm feeling down and self-deprecating, you threaten to shake me. You encourage me, you lighten up my day, and you push me to be better than I was the day before. You see the good in me and allow me to strive for greater holiness. I know there are many uncertainties for our future, but God has given me a great gift in you, and I'll do everything in my power to protect you, to love you, and to lead you toward heaven. I'm excited to continue our walk towards sainthood with you as my wife. I love you a bunch of schnuckums. Yeah, you look stunning. <laughs> look at you. My God. My dearest Lucas, I am so joyful this day has finally arrived. I feel truly blessed. I prayed for many years for God to bring an amazing man into my life, and you far exceed anything that I could have prayed for. I never thought I would meet someone who loved me so abundantly. I truly cherish the love you have for me. You demonstrate so well sacrificial love as you are always putting my needs above your own and looking for ways to make me feel extra loved. I appreciate these things about you and hope that by your example, prayers, and by God's grace, I would be able to grow in these areas as well. I will try my hardest to rely on the Lord to love you, serve you, and cherish you all the days of my life, to help you grow in holiness and grow closer to the Lord. I love you so much. I am extremely excited to do life with you and to take on the responsibility of helping each other get to heaven. Lucas and Michelle, have you come here to enter into marriage without coercion, freely and wholeheartedly? I have. Are you prepared as you follow the path of marriage to love and honor each other for as long as you both shall live? I am. Are you prepared to accept children lovingly from God and to bring them up according to the law of Christ and his church? I am. I, Lucas, take you, Michelle, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and to honor you all the days of my life. I, Michelle, take you, Lucas, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, sickness and in health, to love you and honor you all the days of my life. And may Almighty God bless you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. It's my distinct privilege to introduce to all of you for the very, very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Lucas and Michelle Garrett. Michelle and I met in seventh grade and became quick friends. Since then, we shared countless of memories together from our annual rollerblading trips, um, to late night sleepover shenanigans, to early morning chamber orchestra, to swing dancing at the caves, and even our traveling adventures to Cancun. Since the beginning, we've trusted each other with our hopes, our worries, and our secrets. She has always been like a sister to me. She's always been a loyal friend and supportive, never hesitating to be there for you, even as a third wheel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So when she mentioned this guy, she wasn't quite sure about, but was willing to see what would happen. As time went on, I heard all about him, how smart he was, considerate of others, able to be silly, passionate about his hobbies, willing to participate in any activity Michelle suggested, <laughs> and devotion to God. I haven't been able to have the pleasure of spending a lot of time with Lucas yet. However, the time I have had, I can say that he is a genuine, fun-loving, caring, 
and overall a great catch. I see how much he loves Michelle, and today we get to see that love firsthand. I knew you were the one for Michelle from the way you make her laugh, support all her dreams and house projects, and most importantly, share her faith. I pray that your love continues to grow and strengthen together in both times of joy and times of friendship. Cheers to many years of happiness, love, and faithfulness. I love you both. <laughs> <laughs> Lucas is like a well-loved wood chopping axe. So the handle is worn in, maybe broken. The bit might be chipped, but it's still your favorite axe. Michelle, you have a will of iron and a faith of iron, and iron sharpens iron. It's no wonder that you guys are together, that wisdom sees wisdom, beauty sees beauty, and faith sees faith. So we are here for you. We up on this table are here for you guys. That's kind of why you picked us. When you find yourself as an ax deep in the dirt and you're like, how the heck did I end up here? We're here to help you, sharpen you out, hold your hand, fix your handle, whatever you need. We are here for you. And it's not just for us to witness this today, but to be with you for all days. I am blessed to be your best man. Michelle and Lucas, welcome to your cross.